Well, joining us now is young contemporary jewellery designer and maker Nicholas Hookworth, whose company in the window has a new activewear range, which is really dazzling. Welcome, Nicholas. Thank you, Mel. Really nice to have you here. And I must say, I've been gazing at all your beautiful pieces. Um, what got you into making jewellery and, and how did you know what you wanted to do so young? Well, I've always just loved making things. I mean, you know, at, at kindy, I would just make all day. Um, so when I was 11, I, I went to a school holiday program and made some jewellery and I, I bought it home and people liked it. Um, so I, I made some more and, and that's how I really got started. So what was the first thing you were making when you were 11? What kind of thing were you thinking? Um, so it was just beaded, sort of beaded jewellery, glass beads, that, that kind of thing. Um, terrible colour combinations. <laughs> now, yeah, now I'm a bit, a bit more careful. Um, but yeah, just just whatever caught my fancy, really. And the thing about you is that you you look at these beautiful pieces uh, and you think, gosh, that's quite a range. What a collection! You're 17. You're a 17 year old male who has created this beautiful jewellery. I know, kind of. It is a bit different. It's it's phenomenal. It really is. I mean, where does the inspiration come from? Well, just wherever. I mean, a lot comes from nature because you know, with New Zealand, we have such beautiful, you know, countryside, um, but also, you know, fashion magazines. I might see someone walking down the street and, oh, that, that looks nice on them. I wonder if I could make that a bit differently. Do you take photos of things that you like? Yeah, yeah. I've got at home, I've got a mood board, I've got a big whiteboard and, and I write all my ideas down and then in the holidays I, I try and make it. And what about, like, Instagram? Do you use that as sort of a bit of yeah, inspiration Yeah, yeah. Oh, well? that's a great tool these days. Yeah. It really is, isn't it? I mean, what materials do you like to work with? So I love brass um, and also sterling silver, which most people are familiar with. Yeah. Um, I use rose gold now. That's a little bit of a trend at the moment. Um, and, yeah, just what works together well. So imagine that you're 17, but you're sitting up... Oh, whoops. Oh, no, she's broken it. No, she hasn't. Um, and you're setting up your own company a a yes. as a jewellery designer. I mean, how do you go about setting it up at such a young age? Uh, well, I mean, I, I just started from, you, you know, I had $10 okay. to spend on materials, um, at, you know, for those couple of yeah. pe pieces of jewellery. And I just built it up over time. Um, so, you know, you, you really just start with what you know and then you, you ask people for help um, and, and that's how you get going. Yeah, but it just, we, we, the control room, we're just talking in my ear saying, but you're 17, this is so phenomenal <laughs> to have such a vision about what you want to do at, at such a young age. Um, now, now, you've got some beautiful things. I think we should talk a little bit more about your collection. Let's talk right. about what I am wearing first because you've yes. given me these bits to wear today. Tell me about that. Can we zoom in on that? I'm <laughs> to get my horrible nails out of the way, shall we? <laughs> this one here, what's the signature piece called? So you've got the bee on the branch. Um, it, it's a piece that I created by accident. Um, I was just going to have the branch alone, but then I yeah. added the bee to it, you know. Um, bees are, are quite popular at the moment, I think, maybe because of the New Zealand thing, a lot of honey production here. Yeah, we also like bees because they're good for the, the whole planet. Exactly. We're going to die we don't have bees. They're so important. Yeah. I mean, p people forget. Um, and then the earrings that you've got on are the large monarch, um, monarch wings. Hang on. And they, there we go. See that? How beautiful is that? They really <laughs> catch the light. That, so that's brass and sterling silver. So I've done a mixed metal combination there. So you really do get that inspiration from nature. Yeah. We were talking about your active wear range show. And when I said active wear, I was like, going, what? Has he got somebody in, in leggings or something? But you've got <laughs> these beautiful ones here, uh, which are very little and very light. These two are your active wear range, aren't they? Yes. Part so of we've got the running girl there. Um, so sort of the quintessential, you know, Kiwi runner would love that kind of thing. Um, so that's solid, solid sterling silver, um, and we've got the lotus too, sort of, so sort of inspired by the tranquility um, of, of sort of Pilates. So you have covered off your yoga people and you've covered off your runners, which I think will be a decent present for a lot of people. And have you got a special offer for our viewers? Yes. So I've got $25 off your entire order on my website. Oh, wow. So how do people take advantage of this offer? Um, so they, they go to the website. Um, it's really, really easy to use and there's everything's on there. Hey, thanks so much for coming in, Nicholas. Thank you, Mel. And that web address, again, if you'd like to receive $25 off your purchases, is in thewindow.nz. Beautiful pieces too.